The RC44 class have had a great five days in Marstrand, with 10 fleet races completed under some thrilling race conditions. For Chris Bake and his men, who started the final day 14 points ahead of the rest of the fleet, the job was not to make any mistakes. For the rest of the fleet, points were tight, and the battle was on to see who could secure those all-important podium places. On the final day, it was cold, it was wet, but the intense conditions provided some serious excitement. The wind grew to 28 knots throughout the first race as Ironbound stormed to victory. Their two wins equaled only by Team Aqua at this event. With conditions deteriorating, the first race turned out to be the last. And as the fleet headed for shelter, it was the defending champions who enjoyed their final run into port. Team Aqua's efforts this week enough to secure them the win by an impressive 17-point margin. Yeah, but, you know, the team did really great. I'm not sure I did so well this week, but Cameron got the tactics right to get out the course pretty early on. After a wake-up call on the first race, we sort of didn't look back. I think the concern is that there's a lot of boats doing very well right now, and, and if you look at the, the leaderboard, I think the numbers are a little bit deceptive. Look at the second place, I think there was one point between four boats, so it's, uh, it was pretty intense. For Synergy, a second place and their best ever finish on the tour. And Ajir, well, they're enjoying mixing it up at the top of the table. Uh, we finished third uh, overall, yeah, um, with the same points. I think three boats were on the same points, so we were separated by, uh, by a whisker. Yeah, well, we've got a bit of catching up to do with uh, Team Aqua. They seem to be on a bit of a different plane to the rest of us. Hopefully in, in Cascais we can start off from here instead of starting from the back and trying to work up again. Just past the halfway stage, racing resumes in October at the RC44 Cash Guys Cup, where we wait to see if anyone can reel in the mighty Team Aqua.